First on Fox News tonight, a pregnant woman walking down the street with her daughter and her dog are allegedly attacked by two pit bulls. That woman says if it wasn't for a stranger who jumped in to help in the situation, it could have turned deadly. Fox News reporter Dave Bondi joins us in the studio. And Dave, she says it's vital that they find one of the dogs. Well, it's important. She's hoping for that at this time. And her name is Christy Giles. She was yelling for help. She couldn't get away. She had a pit bull on each of her legs. Now, it was a few minutes into the attack when a stranger came to Christy's aid, saving her from further injury. It was a sur surreal situation. I looked down and could see both of them had clamped a halt of my legs. And this is what Christy Giles' legs looked like after being attacked by two dogs she believed to be pit bulls. This all happened as she walked down this street with her one-year-old daughter, Kaylee, and her toy poodle, Nikki. I'm just screaming for help the whole time. And when she felt there was no way out, Roger Hansick pulled around the corner in his pickup truck. I heard this lady hollering, help me, help me, and there was two pit bulls uh, attacking her. So I got out and I ran over and kicked one in the throat, which had a hold of her right leg, and that broke him loose and kicked the other one in the ribs as hard as I could. Giles and her husband, Lee, credits Hansack with saving not only Christie's life, but their one-year-old daughter, Kaylee, and the family's toy poodle. He is my hero now. He is definitely. He saved, I honest to God believe, he saved my wife and my baby's life. And I really do believe that. If it wouldn't have been for him, there's no telling what could have happened. Christy received 60 stitches and may have to undergo rabies shots if one of the dogs that attacked her is not found. As for Hansick, he hopes anyone would have stepped up and helped a fellow neighbor. All I could see was that look on her face, and it just it really bothered me. And... Now, police have questioned the owner of the dogs. It's not known at this time what, if any, charges will be filed. As for Giles, she hopes that that remaining dog is found.